How's it going, everyone? This is Caleb here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Mod Showcases. And in today's video, we are going to show you guys the food mod. So let's get straight into it. Now, the first thing that I need to show you guys is the brand new crops. And look at all these. Look at all these. You see all these? All of these are brand new crops. Every single one. This is absolutely crazy. But so let's get into it and go as slowly, well, actually as quickly, because there is so much stuff that this mod is, adds in as possible. So let's go right now. So I'm actually going to zoom in right there. All right. So the first thing that it adds in right here is the blackberry, and then we have blueberries, we have candleberries, raspberries, strawberries, cactus fruit, asparagus, barley, oats, rye, corn, bamboo shoots, cantaloupe, cucumbers, winter squash, zucchini, beets, onions, parsnips, and peanuts, and we also have radish, radabaga, sweet potatoes, turnips, rhubarb, celery, garlic, ginger, spice leaves, tea leaves, coffee beans and mustard but that's only one side look at all this food look at all of that just on the one side so now if we just run over here then we do the other one we can get straight into that and this mod also adds in broccoli cauliflower leeks lettuce scallion artichokes brussels sprouts cabbage spinach white mushrooms beans and soybeans we also have bell peppers chili peppers eggplants okra peas tomatoes cottons and pineapples and we have the grapes we have the kiwi we have the cranberries, we have the bean, greens, beans, potatoes, tomatoes, and we also have the rice. We have the seaweeds, we have the curries, the leaves, the sesame, street, the sesame seeds, and finally the water chestnuts. So that's all of the crops that this thing adds in. But we do also have ourselves some brand new trees. So these are, they're new saplings. Each one of these has a brand new sapling. And basically what they are, they're either an oak tree or a jungle tree, and they all grow brand new um like fruits and stuff so here we have the date tree so here is a date here is a papaya i have no idea how to pronounce that so i'm just going to assume i did that right we have cherry trees right here we have dragon fruit we have my favorite of them all apples look at how lovely this is look at it it's absolutely beautiful i love that apple so darn much all right then we have right here we have the lemon we have the pear and then back here we also have olives so those are those new trees and then we have this real wild thing over here to get into. So we also here have fig right here. We have the grapefruit. We have pomegranate. We have cashews and we have vanilla beans. We also have pecans, avocados, plums, bananas, which I love. Then we have star fruit. We have pistachios. We have limes. We have peppercorn, almonds, and gooseberries. We have apricots, mangoes. We have coconuts, chestnuts and peaches and oranges and walnuts and per per simon per whatever and we have nutmeg and we have durian and we also have three other new types of trees that do not grow anything but look at all these fruits oh my goodness this is just absolutely crazy how much stuff this amount adds and also here we have the cinnamon tree so what you do is you would right click the bark and then you'll get some cinnamon that'll fly right out here and you can hear you can get the cinnamon wood which is right here and cinnamon of course right there so that is the cinnamon tree then we have here the maple tree so you guys can see we have like this brown little thing right here when you see that and you right click it you will get yourself a jar of maple syrup so we can just do that to these two as well as you can see we now have three jars so yeah, as you can see here that gives out maple syrup and that is what that does and then finally here we have paper bark tree so if we were to right click the paper bark tree we get paper, which is quite cool. And I really, really like the way that this thing looks. Like, that's just a really, really cool building block. So, yeah, those are all of the plants. But this mod does not add in just plants slash trees slash vegetables slash clubs. Blah, 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 blah. It also adds in blocks and a whole wide variety of other food and some other random stuff that we're going to get into as well. So, let's get into the blocks. Now, the first block that we have right here is called the market. Now, the market is a block you can craft. By the way, guys, I am not going to be showing you guys the crafting recipes because I don't want to spend my entire life doing that. So, because seriously, there is so much. This mod literally adds in over a thousand items. So, yeah, there's no way that I can get into the crafting recipe for all of these blocks or all these foods. So, I am sorry about that. But we can still move on anyway. So, this is the market. And when you right-click it, you can buy a whole bunch of spinach seeds, kiwi seeds, cabbage. You can buy so many seeds right here. All for one emerald. Uh, so, that's pretty cool. So, you can just scroll through there and get that stuff. Next here, we have ground traps. Now, what you do with the ground trap is you will put some bait that you can get into them. And then, it'll catch stuff. So, here we see... I have put three in here. So let's see. This one has been here for a while. So this has fruit bait. And it has gotten me a feather, an egg, and two raw chickens. Which is kind of weird. Kind of weird. I don't know how the fruit bait attracted a feather. I mean, I don't know. That's just weird. Then over here we have the grain bait, which is attracted two feathers and a bone. 
<laughs> Again, don't quite understand the logic behind that. And then we have the Veggie Beat, which is, uh, which is summoned in some raw venison, two feathers, and a bone. So yeah, that's that stuff. So that is that right there. Next here, we have the Beehive. Now I'm going to hop into game mode one. So when you break the Beehive, I'm just going to break it right here, you will get yourself one Queen Bee. So this is the Queen Bee right here. Now what you will do with this guy is you will put him into this thing right here, which is called an Apiary. So when I do that, as you see, I already put a Queen Bee in here. You will get all types of stuff in here. So you can get yourself some wax combs, some honeycombs, or Bee Grub. So Bee Grub's kind of gross, but you can get that as well. So... Then also, of course, we have the barks that I showed you guys, the maple wood and the paperback. Then here we have the honeycomb block, which is actually really, really cool. I really like the way it looks like. It kind of reminds me of cereal. I mean, don't ask me why. It just looks like cereal to me. And then we can go down here. Here we have a well. Now, what the well does is it is a one block unlimited supply of water. So if I grab this water bucket, I could just right click this for days. Look, I'm never going to run out of water ever. Oh, oh, that was not a good idea. Uh, 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 oh, 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 dear much better there we go that's right you're gone anyway so yeah that is that then we also have here which is a water trap so what you would do is you put a bait in there and you get water you would get seafood is what i meant to say so i have actually set up two right here so here is one of them right here which is the water trap so if we just go down here we have this thing and as you can see we got ourselves some heartfish we got turtle we got shrimp jellyfish shrimp and grouper we got a whole bunch of stuff down there and then i also threw one down here right as well so as you can see we got ourselves some shrimp some octopus some clams some perch and some salmon as well so yeah that's pretty cool and there's a very very useful and so now what we can do is we can get into the next one which of course here is the cinnamon wood i've already showed you that here we have a honey block which looks really really cool i really really like the way that looks we also have a wax a wax comb block a pressed wax block and a presser i have no clue what the presser does honestly i i i, I just don't know i have no clue what you're supposed to do with this stuff but you know what i'm gonna give a couple seconds for text to on, appear on screen right now telling you what you're supposed to do with it there you go that's what you're supposed to do with it so yeah now we also have ourselves some brand new cakes we are actually on to the food now so now we have here the carrot cake we have holiday cake right there then we have some pumpkin cheesecake some pav pavlova which is crying to cool right there then we have some lamington some cheesecake which is absolutely delicious cherry cheesecake pineapple upside down cake some chocolate sprinkles cake which is probably going to be my favorite of the batch and then of course we have red velvet cake which just looks delicious it looks great so now we have the other food to get into and look at this look at how glitchy this is look at all that stuff anyway so this right here is as you can see right here the light meals so i'm just gonna go over it like really like pretty quickly and you can just kind of see the stuff that's in here for yourself but i'll just name off a few things here we here we have a caramel apples we have a whole bunch of juice right here we have some sandwiches we have mashed potatoes we have the fish sticks and hot chocolate spaghetti tomato soup it's delicious then of course down here we have spring salad which is amazing we have some corn on the cob and tortillas we have a peanut butter and jelly sandwich we have pickles which is just delicious i love pickles so much then of course we have some stuffed pepper which is pretty cool lemon bars we have some pancakes as well and we have some pickled beets which is pretty pretty cool right there so and then we also have some properly soup, properly broccoli soup. We also have some gingerbread. We have a whole bunch of spark garlic stuff. We have papaya yolk. We have banana splits. We've got all the food right here, which is just delicious. And then the final chest of this stuff. Oh, and then there's that one and that one and that one. Yeah, there's so much. Anyway, so yeah. So we have all of this stuff in here as well, as you can see right there. Then we got all this stuff and this stuff and this stuff and this stuff. It's crazy. It's crazy. And that's just the light meals. We also have large meals which are right here so i love this stuff because you get yourself the pizza you get zesty zucchini which i think is hilarious then we have the baked ham right there we have epic bacon i'm gonna eat this epic bacon because i am actually very curious as to what this does for you so uh yeah let's see if i kill critic minecraft hunger one blah, 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 boom and boom there we go now let's see what will this epic bacon do whoa it like completely fills you up that's actually really really cool so now we can move on and do some more stuff right here. Do, 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 do. All right. So now we also have ourselves some more burgers. We have beef wellington. We have heartfish and turtle, which is kind of sad. Then we have corned beef. We have uh, some stuff right here. Battered sausage. We have sausage and dim sum, which is awesome. And then we have this stuff over here. Nether wings. I'm going to eat the nether wings later on, too. 
Then we have, of course, the chocolate rolls and the honey. We have ourselves all this stuff right here, this stuff right here, and this stuff right here. And all of these are snacks, by the way. So yeah, but then over here we have the random stuff. So this here is hardened leather helmet. And like this is the hardened leather set. And I'm actually gonna wear this stuff real quick. So let's see if I can just find a way to get it, get it, get the stuff. There we go. I look absolutely amazing. Look at me. I'm so cool now. So yeah, that is that. We also have a wide variety of candles that you can get as well. You have these random little things right here, like the like this stuff. Now I'm gonna show you this stuff separately. So like, you will find a whole bunch of new bushes and stuff. Like, over here, you have some more bushes. So, let's see. I'm just going to place down quite a few of this stuff. And you can just show... I can show you what this stuff gets. So, here we go. We'll just put all of this stuff right there. So, now, when I get out of game mode 1 right here, when I break this stuff, I will be getting... Well, I will be receiving a wide variety of the new plants. And you will find these things just randomly spawning in your world as well. Like, over here, here are some naturally spawning ones as well. So, like, look at all of this. We got the parsnip, we got weed, we got a whole bunch of great stuff. So, yeah, that's what that stuff does over there. And then, of course, over here we still have some more really, really weird and random stuff. A whole bunch of materials, mostly, that you use to craft the stuff that you need for the food. And then, of course, you have that right there. So, yeah, all thousand something of those items are everything that this mod adds in so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you do want this mod for yourself the link to download it is in the description below so yeah go down there to get it and also the forge download because you do need forge for i think 1.11.2 in order to do this so yeah that is all for today's video thank you so much for watching and i will see you all in the next video bye